Welcome to Research Business Daily Report, where market researchers come for news, insights, and commentary about the market research field. And we provide knowledge and assorted other valuable information and insights that impact them both inside and outside their current place of business. On RBDR today, the decisions which CMOs make concerning research technology acquisitions, and they are pretty heavy duty. Plus, Kantar Media issues a strongly worded warning about the dominance of inconsistent media metrics and the need for some consistency. RBDR is sponsored today and this week by the Video Testimonial Service, an offering that combines the effectiveness of video and the power of a customer's perspective so that we can bring your company's product or service experiences to life in a way that other methods simply can't touch. In short, you tell us about a particular customer whose problem you've solved, and we will use our 23 years of research industry experience to speak with that loyal, highly satisfied customer, and then turn around and present their most positive experiences in a way that will be most compelling. Video testimonials have been shown to have very hard-hitting effectiveness, much more so than, for example, case histories, which tend to predominate on most websites. And that means that the video testimonial can help build your revenues and your profits. And what's more important than that? You know the answer. We will tailor your customer video testimonial to your specific and exacting needs and give you multiple deliverables in various lengths which have been proven to be most effective in other testimonial situations. So let's discuss your situation, your needs, and how we can help you. On the screen to my right, you can see my email address and my phone number, and I look forward to hearing from you at your earliest convenience. Forrester Research VP and a Principal Analyst Andrew Bartels revealed details from several studies done by Forrester. Now, one of the gems is an analyst estimate that 37% of all new technology spending is related to the CMO and they have control over it. For instance, marketing automation software of keen interest to research, marketing data analytics, again, of great interest to researchers, plus mobile apps and more. Marketing automation software, it turns out, falls under the CRM umbrella, and that may put research in or outside of the picture in those situations. Moving on, Andy Brown, Cantar Media CEO and Chairman, shared highlights from his business's Dimension Study, which explores key communication, planning, buying, and measurement issues, both for consumers and the industry. The study declares, quote, a lack of consistent, comparable measures to understand audience and gauge the effectiveness of advertising, which, Brown says, is a significant concern for those working in the communication planning ecosystem. The study goes on to warn that over-targeting, and I thought this was most important of everything Brown had to say, could alienate consumers who broadly, quote, have no fundamental problem with advertising, and it is damaging their relationship with brands. Without the availability of consistent comparable metrics, says Brown, brand and the advertising industry cannot accurately measure their audience, the impact and effectiveness of their marketing, or the accuracy of individual campaigns. And Brown went on to say that unless we work together to solve the problem, the growth in this sector will be hindered. That is your Research Business Daily Report. We hope you have a tremendous research day, not just a great one. And we'll see you back here tomorrow.